welcome or welcome back to my channel I'm assuming most of you guys will be new but you never know you might be an OG my name is Kelsey and this is Krusty my literal child Krusty Krust oldest sweetest boy I am a full-time content creator and I live in New York City and I'm also working on starting my own beauty brand YouTube has literally always been my all-time favorite platform to consume content on like I'm a YouTube girly through and through and I attempted to do the whole YouTube thing about two years ago when I first started social media and quit my corporate job but I was living in San Diego temporarily at the time I moved to New York City there was a lot going on um, and so I kind of gave up the whole YouTube thing because it is honestly very challenging but 2024 we're bringing the YouTube back and we're here to stay baby YouTube 2024 I think I'll be primarily vlogging on this channel but let me know if there's anything else you guys want to see I do a ton of beauty content on TikTok and Instagram a little fashion content sprinkled here and there so just let me know whatever you guys want to see anyways today is Monday it is January 15th it is freezing outside but this morning I just did my whole normal morning routine take Krusty on a walk go to Pilates come home shower eat breakfast and then I usually just get straight into filming my like TikTok and Instagram content for the day and try to get everything done before lunchtime that way I have the entire afternoon to like edit do admin stuff run errands go to events whatever I need to do that day and this week is honestly super chill compared to a like normal week even though there's not really a normal week in this sort of job but I have a very chill week and I'm very happy about it because like I said it is freezing in New York right now like literally it's in, like in the 20s I just looked let's see what the weather is right now it's literally 30 degrees and then it says feels like 24 degrees like not okay I'm from California that's not okay anyways I'm very happy that my week is chill so that way we don't have to be out in the cold that much so I finished all my filming this morning I just have like some editing I have to post my content for the day and yeah so we're gonna get into that do a little admin work computer work just okay so I just finished up all my editing and emails and stuff and my friend Macy actually texted me and she's like oh do you want to go to the movies tonight and I keep forgetting that today is actually a holiday for like people with like normal nine to fives I guess that's kind of irrelevant actually because Macy doesn't work like a normal nine to five but Anyways, it's a holiday, and <laughs> so like no one's really working today. So we are gonna go to the movies. We're gonna see the Wonka movie, which is like honestly kind of random, but I'm excited. I think it's a musical. I love a musical. I was a theater kid, so I'm gonna go see that. It's actually really funny because I honestly don't really like going to the movies very much, and I hadn't been in like literal years, and then I've been to the movies like four times in the past two months and now I'm like kind of like it <laughs> and I do feel like it's a good like winter activity it's almost four o'clock I'm gonna take Sir Krusty out he's bugging me to go out so we're gonna go on a little walk and then I'm gonna get him situated um before the movie is at like 5 30 I think so you ready to go for a walk <gasps> you want to go for a walk oh my god let's go here is my <laughs> little outfit for the walk I have the gray sweater that I was wearing it's from revolve and then my pants are just these silk pants which I literally wear non-stop they're from mango um, and they are actually the best thing I ever bought and then this big fur coat is the Frankie shop I just got it from net-a-porter and I'm 
actually obsessed with it. It is incredible and it's super warm and it's freezing outside. I wish that I could wear a beanie, but I'm wearing a bun. So I feel like that's not a thing. So I'm just gonna wear my AirPod Maxes as like earmuffs, which is honestly the best hack. So, Crest, you ready to go for a walk? Yeah. <laughs> hello good morning it is tuesday i didn't end up vlogging when i got home last night but the movie we saw wonka i can't remember if i said that or not um we saw the new wonka movie with Tim Tim with timothy chalamet can't speak it was really cute i liked it it was a musical I love a musical. Gives me an entire new perspective on Kylie Jenner because the fact that she is dating him is just so interesting. Like, love it, but it's also very interesting. But anyways, it is fully a snow day this morning. I was on the wait list for my Pilates class this morning and I didn't end up getting in. So when I checked at like seven o'clock this morning, I wasn't in and I was like, you know what? Maybe I'll just like sleep in a little bit. So I didn't really sleep in. I slept for like maybe 20 more minutes. I took Krusty out for the first time in the snow and he liked it. It was actually successful. I'll like insert some clips because he was being really cute. He 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 enjoyed it, I think. He was a little confused, but he enjoyed it. Did you like the snow? Are you a little snow chihuahua? Snow chihuahua. Yeah. Well, I just got in the shower and I needed to wash my hair. So it's like 9.30 now and I think we're just going to kind of have like a lazy snow day. I have all my content filmed for that I'm going to post today um, from yesterday. So I don't have anything to film. So I'm just going to like stay no makeup. Just probably do a bunch of stuff on my computer and like stay home today. So we'll see what we get into. Please look at how he sits on me. He loves his tummy scratches. Oh, another thing I wanted to mention is that I woke up this morning to 30,000 followers on Instagram, which is ridiculous because I have like, I think I have like 180,000 on TikTok, but my TikTok has always been like so much bigger than Instagram. Like Instagram hates me. I hate Instagram. So I've had a really hard time trying to grow on Instagram because of the type of content that I post on TikTok and does well on TikTok is like me talking to the camera and I feel like that does not perform as well on TikTok. But my Healthy Hair for Dummies uh, like series announcement video is like popping off. It has like a half a million views right now. So I've literally gotten like, I've doubled my following in the past like 48 hours. I'm not even joking. Like I think on Friday I had like 13.5 thousand followers and now I have, I almost have 31,000 followers. That is just like absurd to me. That's a good way to start the day. <laughs> I finally like look like I'm an influencer on Instagram. Who would have ever thought that would have happened? I was like, whatever, you know, I don't really care about Instagram. TikTok's where it's at, but maybe not, maybe not. I'm gonna blow dry my hair in a little bit but i do want to put in my products first and then let it air dry for a little bit so first i'm gonna do redken one united i'm just gonna spray a tiny bit of this before i detangle always start at the bottom and work my way up i feel like i've been using like a bunch of the same products over and over again recently which is like a good and a bad thing like i'm sure it's good for my hair that i keep using the same products but also, like, my job is to try new hair products, so I need to, like, switch it up a little bit. I need to, like, fully refresh my shower. Then I'm going to use my Living Proof Triple Bond Complex. Not me doing the YouTube hand. There we go. And I'm going to do a couple pumps of that. Probably don't need that much because my hair is short, but I do have a lot of hair, so... I feel like my hair can handle anything. <laughs> my hair absorbs literally everything, it's insane. And then you're supposed to let that sit for 10 minutes before 
putting heat on it which is why i like to use that when i'm like letting my hair air dry a little bit while that's absorbing into my hair i'm gonna go in with this divi scalp serum that i'm trying out this is only my second time using it but i do love to use a scalp serum really consistently so i'm just testing this one out just massage that in i'm gonna let this air dry for a little bit and then i'll come back when i'm actually gonna blow dry my hair i just made some lunch i made this little greek bowl which i'm so excited about i am like addicted to greek food i could eat it for every single meal of the day and i pretty much do to be honest so i made a little like greek salad concoction cucumbers tomatoes red onion i'm out of olives and i'm really disappointed about it and then some romaine lettuce and then i just got this um it's like healthy rice it's from the brand fiber gourmet which i eat their pasta and it's so fucking good it's like high protein low calorie low carbs it's so 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 good and they just came out with rice so this is my first time trying the rice um these little chicken meatballs and tzatziki and this is honestly my perfect meal and i'm really excited to see if the rice is good um and then i have a little olipop and i'm probably gonna watch some youtube <laughs> okay when people ask me why i do not air dry my hair this is why this is what it looks like it's literally insane almost like 4 p.m i haven't touched my hair my hair is still like sopping wet in the back like my hair does not dry all the way so now i'm gonna go in with my blow dryer now i'm taking my orbe super shine cream and i'm just gonna use a tiny bit of this since my hair is almost dry and i'm just gonna put that towards the ends of my hair this is like my all-time favorite hair product. It's so nice. It smells amazing. Makes your hair so shiny. And I just feel like it's like one of the best products ever for frizz. And it always makes my blow-dried hair look really good. Okay, we're all blow-dried. Much better. Um, I'm actually not going to straighten it or anything today. Since I'm not going anywhere, I'm just going to kind of leave it. It's always a little like puffy after I blow dry it so I do like sleeping on it if I'm like not gonna go anywhere so I think I'm just gonna leave it and I will just like probably put it in a claw clip when I have to like take Krusty out because the thing about living in my neighborhood I live in West Village which is the best neighborhood ever I'm so grateful and thankful to live in this neighborhood however having a dog having a dog and having to take him out multiple times a day when you live in a very busy pop in neighborhood in New York City it's it's not the greatest feeling when you like go out there to walk your dog and you like look like shit so I do always attempt to somewhat pull myself together because I live like on a busy street and there's always a zillion people around however it is a snow day so there's probably not very many people out pointless rant but at least my hair is blow dried feeling a little better i have literally just been working on my computer all day um i've been sitting on the couch i kind of honestly think i'm gonna move and sit on my bed because it is just like calling my name i really try hard to not work from bed basically ever just because i'm way more productive when i'm obviously not sitting in my bed like that's not what you're supposed to do but sometimes i like have this thought to myself and i'm like you know what i'm so grateful and thankful that this is my job and that i do have such a flexible schedule I'm like, why don't I just sit in my bed sometimes? It's like, it's a snowy Tuesday. I don't have any meetings. I'm just doing shit on my computer. There's no reason I can't sit in my bed. Like, let's go. I just took Krusty out. It's like 9.30 and it is literally like 17 degrees outside. So fucking cold. I, I feel like my fingers are gonna break off. Good morning. It is Wednesday now. It's the next day. It's like 6.45. I need to go take Krusty out and feed him because I have a 7.30 a.m. Pilates class. On Wednesdays, my Pilates class is earlier than usual, so gotta go do that. I'm very tired. I am home from Pilates, just ate some breakfast, enjoying my coffee. Krusty's going insane with his toys right now. Huh, you love to play. You love to play, I know you do. Um, I was maybe gonna try to go work from a coffee shop today, but it is way too fucking cold. Oh, 
that's my alarm for my laundry but it's way 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 too cold and i think i'm actually gonna go to dinner and like go out tonight um so i don't want to leave crusty in his crate like all day when i if i was to like work from a coffee shop and then also leave him at night so i think i might work from a coffee shop tomorrow instead because it is supposed to be slightly warmer not by much but it is like freezing i think that's the coldest temperature i've ever been in in my whole life i'm not even exaggerating <laughs> like i've never been in the cold i'm from california i am gonna go grab my laundry and then shower and get ready and get into filming for the day i have a few like concepts and things that i have to submit for some upcoming brand deals so i have some computer work just work to get done this morning like vacuum tidy up in here yeah, it's nice and clean, huh, Chris? And I just opened a few packages and I got the new Way Hair Gloss, which I'm actually working with them on a video. So I am so excited to try this stuff. I am like a big hair gloss girly and I absolutely love Way. Like they're one of my all-time favorite brands. So very excited about that. And then I also got this massive package from Hourglass, which is another one of my all-time favorite brands. This is probably my favorite makeup brand, honestly. And it is their new lip liners. I'm so excited. I've been seeing a bunch of people post about them and they're supposed to be like super, super long lasting. And they also have these volumizing glossy lip balms, which I'm obsessed with. And also they're, I think they're like a satin matte lipstick, soft matte lipstick. They're super comfortable. These, this is like one of my favorite lipstick formulas ever. Um, so very excited about that. Okay, so I just filmed a few things. I ended up not getting ready and just doing all the videos for today with um, no makeup. And now I'm just eating lunch. I made extra of the same thing I made yesterday, the like Greek bowl. And I'm literally, I've been so excited all morning to eat this. Like, it's so fucking good. I have a meeting with my talent manager in about 30 minutes. So I'm just gonna eat lunch and then I'm gonna have my weekly meeting with her. We just kind of like touch base, go over all my campaigns that I have coming up. We like talk through if I like want her to pitch me to any specific brand or like big updates on whatever, like travel plans or anything like that. Maybe some Instagram strategy since now I have like 35,000 followers and literally on Friday I had like 13,000. So that opens a lot of new doors on Instagram because now I can really start like working with brands on Instagram. And I had before a little bit, but having 30K versus like 12 or 13K is like a massive difference. So cheers to that. I think I'm gonna go get my nails done actually because I haven't gotten them done in like a month, I wanna say. They're like very grown out. They still actually like look okay, but I think I wanna get them done. I'm either gonna go after lunch or maybe I'll go tomorrow, but I'm kind of thinking today, but then again, it's so cold. Hi. 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 It's much later. It's like 6 p.m. now. I just got back inside and I'm taking Krusty out and it is still freezing, shocker. I did not go and get my nails done, shocker. It's just too damn cold. Like, I, I can't do that. I am about to start getting ready because I'm actually going on a date, which I was like not gonna say anything, but then I was like, who the fuck cares? <laughs> That's what I'm doing. I'm going on a date. So I'm gonna get ready for that right now. And I will not be taking you with me because that's just, you know, not how a first date goes. <laughs> but <laughs> that's what I'm doing tonight. So I will see you tomorrow. Um, wow, I feel like I literally have not been wearing makeup this entire vlog. So apologies, but it's actually Friday. I didn't end up vlogging yesterday. I had a doctor's appointment in the middle of the day and it just kind of like unexpectedly took over my whole day. So I literally didn't do anything interesting and like it was kind of just like a wash of a day. So I just didn't vlog at all. And then today it's actually supposed to snow all day. Lovely. This is gonna be like the most boring vlog ever because I've like been in my apartment all week, but it is what it is. It's New York City in the winter. Like it's just real life, but it's like 7.30 right now. Um, I just took Krusty out. Um, I also forgot to sign up for my Pilates class, or I didn't forget to sign up for it, but I didn't get into it because I forgot to sign up earlier. My Pilates studio, like when I first started going there, 
it was a brand new studio so the classes were like never full and I could sign up like the week of or even the day of like all the time. But now it's been open for like a year and the classes like fill up now which is like obviously a good thing for their business but it's annoying for me because now I like have to book my workouts like really far in advance but it is what it is. I guess I'm not working out today. I'm gonna make some breakfast and then I have a dentist appointment today actually and I need to figure out if I wanna like shower and get ready before or after the dentist. So that's what I'm currently contemplating. So I clearly decided to not wash my hair before going to the dentist. I just figure it's gonna be easier if I just do it after and have it fresh for the weekend. So this is what I'm wearing to the dentist, just very lazy. The sweat set is from Elwood. It's like literally my favorite brand of sweats. So comfy, really good quality. My new Nike's on and just a bun and I just like threw on some concealer so that I don't look like a complete zombie. But I'm just gonna wear my big um, Aritzia Super Puff over this because it's snowing and I need a hood and it's freezing, so off to the dentist. I got home from the dentist a while ago. I think it's like 4.30 or 4.45 now, so I'm gonna take Krusty out again. I'm going back and forth whether or not I want to like go out tonight or stay in. It's been snowing all day and I'm literally dreading going outside. It's supposed to be so cold. So I'm like, I feel like I should just stay in tonight and then maybe I can go do something tomorrow. But it's actually supposed to be colder tomorrow than it is today. So I don't know, I'm very torn. But a Friday night in does sound kind of nice, even though I've been in my apartment all week, but like going out in the cold tonight, like just does not sound fun. So I don't know, I'm gonna talk to some of my friends and see what we decide. We officially decided to stay in, so I ordered sushi. And this literally took like two hours to get here. Like I am perplexed. I mean, I guess because it's snowing and probably everyone on the planet is ordering delivery, but I'm excited to eat my sushi. And then I'm gonna watch season, either season two or season three of the morning show. I know I for sure watched the first season and I'm trying to figure out if I watched the second season or not. <laughs> I can't remember. But that's gonna be our little Friday night in. Yeah.